Hey, you, you want to know what Valentine's Day is like for men? All right, warning. This is going to get racy, so if you get easily offended, stop watching right now. All right, this is what Valentine's Day is like for most men. Imagine that for you, this wonderful woman who's generous and you care about your man and you want to provide his needs in a way that makes you feel good and him feel good. Well, because of Hallmark, on whatever given day, March 12th, you have got to offer up the best blowjob you've ever given. Not only is it the best, best one ever, it's gonna to have to top last year's, which I suppose that's obvious if it's the best one ever. It also, because he's gonna to talk to all of his friends about what he got for, for the, this particular holiday, um, it's gonna to have to be better than all of his friends' women provided for their men. How about that? On demand, best BJ ever, because it's some day that Hallmark decided you were supposed to do that. How unmotivating is that, right? Because here you are, you want to provide that or your own version of that for him, but not because it's demanded. So that's what it's like for men. Men who ordinarily are providers and they're romantic and they want to, on their own terms, they want to provide all this great stuff for you, but now they're told Thursday, <laughs> the 14th, cough up the goods, dude, or else. You're in deep doo-doo. Bad, bad, bad. So my suggestion to you is take him off the hook. Now he's probably got some stuff already on the works because it's two days away. But, and maybe you're gonna see this after the fact in which case you can learn from what it was like and plan for next year. Take him off the hook. Whether you just do nothing or you can say, honey, because you are so great to me all year, I'm gonna make you a sumptuous feast that night or I'm gonna rub your feet or I'm gonna take you to the movies or take him off the hook and watch what happens to him. Oh my God. <laughs> In fact, I would love to hear. So email me and let me know, all right? Karen at theheartmatters.com. Have a great Valentine's. Bye for now.